video is disturbing and oh so infuriating. The woman, 68 years old, punched on the steps of her Greek Orthodox Church in Jamaica Hills this past Sunday. She was critically injured and she remains in the hospital tonight with severe head injuries. Her attacker is still on the loose. But her family tonight speaking to Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Richardson. She's at the church with our lead story tonight. Kim. Well, Bill, she never saw it coming, and by the time she did, it was too late. That suspect, he viciously attacked this 68-year-old woman here on the steps to this church. In the hospital, her family tells me she has a fractured skull. They are both furious and scared. They asked we not show her face. There you see a mother of two doing what she does every Sunday, heading to service here at St. Demetrios Greek Orthodox Church in Jamaica Hills. Daniel, a close family friend, considers the 68-year-old an aunt, tells me by phone Irene is a kind, gentle woman. We're only using her first name. Salt of the earth, godly woman. She wouldn't even hurt a fly. She's just such a nice lady anything she would take the shirt off her back look closely at that same video there's a man a stranger following irene around 8 30 in the morning services were underway inside as she walks up the steps he runs in front of her violently shoves her she falls backwards daniel tells me irene is now in the hospital with a fractured skull and black eye she was in and out of consciousness yesterday Today she's awake, but she's not talking. She's not verbal. She could say like one word. After the assault, the suspect grabbed Irene's purse with her car keys and cell phone inside. He ended up stealing her Nissan, which police did recover today. The suspect is still out there. The victim's family is terrified, trying to figure out why on earth someone would be so cruel to someone who was simply heading to worship. I, I almost cried. I was, it was devastating. I'm um, part of the civilian patrol, and it's scary because the people don't even fear real cops. It's an animal. He deserves to be locked up. The full book thrown at him. And Daniel tells me family members just recently gave Irene that car so she wouldn't have to take the bus here to church. At this hour, no arrests. For now, we're live in Jamaica Hills, Kimberly Richardson, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.